A question of character. The guerrilla leader fights for glory. Hail the heroes of the revolution. The guerrilla leader despises the smiling king. The king dominates the country with cruelty. Not anymore. It will be war with gorillas. But not the banana type, the bearded type. He is master of all things gorilla. Gorilla boats. Gorilla tanks. Gorilla weaponry. The gorilla gun. It fires lethal white pellets, unlimited spears of death. The king's army also possesses these deadly ballistic spears. In this country, ammunition is cheap and plentiful. Elegant salt salt. Land ho, land hell. Taste my pellets. Violent white pellets rip into the enemy's flesh, piercing their battle dress uniform. A crimson mist tints the air of the otherwise beautiful landscape. Then they vanish. The gorilla leader is unmoved. Such is life in this horrid kingdom. His compatriots are in bondage, wiggling for freedom. The gorilla leader is their bearded savior. However, the gorilla leader is not perfect. Sometimes Sometimes he may have an oopsie. oopsie. The guerrilla leader loses battle points. The enemy will chase the hostages. The guerrilla leader will fry them and hey, wait! The guerrilla leader does whatever it takes to save the hostages, even lassoing their necks while in a mine cart. Get in here! Get in this cart! Get in here! I'm saving you. The guerrilla leader tries his best to rescue all of the hostages. But if he can't, it doesn't really matter. The guerrilla leader uses a detailed map with a cute figurine of his likeness. I am here. I need to be there. The mere presence of the guerrilla leader causes the enemy to surrender because of his armament. Like T, a rocket launcher that shoots rockets, but then the rockets shoot bullets. Amazing! A flamed thrower destroying two entire tanks at the same time and boils the underwater fools. The guerrilla leader's grenades are explosive, destroying barricades, destroying hope and bridges. He must not destroy the bridge. It must be cared for to allow the tank. Yes, he has a tank. It mimics the guerrilla leader's weaponry. The guerrilla leader sprays. The tank Tank will also spray. Failure to escape a flashing tank will cause death. The guerrilla leader fights through the jungles, the swamps. He will fight through the poop of his nation using sewer tactics. The guerrilla leader deals with a dull enemy, throwing him where he wants to go. They wear color-coded battle dress uniforms. Red soldiers have weapons, not to use, but to have taken. Fellow soldiers, boss guarding commandos, and the crazy blue sacrificing themselves with explosives for the horrible king, knowing his soldiers' lives are dispensable. Sorry, pig. Oops. Ironically, even with all of his firepower, the guerrilla leader is incredibly weak. He cannot be touched. His blue uniform, green fatigues, and nifty hat protect nothing. He is of withered paper. Luckily, the gorilla leader has the swift movement of a distressed gorilla. The animal kind. Dodging rockets, bullets, and people. Because remember, they can kill him. Oopsie. Power. Excellent. Weapons are as plentiful as littered corpses. Well, if the corpses did not disappear. Defense. Long. The gorilla leader is incredibly fragile, but his heart is incredibly strong. Strong. However, hard it does not stop bullets. Agility. Excellent. The gorilla leader maneuvers through water, land, and trenches as if he lives there. And he does. Oopsie. Grade B. The gorilla leader fights as one, but also many. Willing to topple an entire army and its giddy king without question. One of the truest heroes. Through the hairs of revolution, he will save his country and make sure everyone makes it home alive. Well, mostly. Oopsie. Next episode. What do stars and foxes have in common? Not much. But for some reason, they're both in space.
Quest with me. Learn with us. Enrich your mind. Empower your inquiry. Like our material. Subscribe to our page. Put character into quest. Return every Monday for more. A question of character.